There's a saying in rowing that training is the opposite of hoping. So when I decided to make a video for a day in the life of an Olympic hopeful in rowing, it just sort of became ironic to me. And I realized that it's not really about saying, you know, well, I rowed this hard, or I pulled this split, or I ate this, or I took a nap. And realizing that it's more about a series of questions that I ask myself every day. And how I go about answering those questions is really what defines what I do. I mean, it starts pretty basically. It started with, am I rested? Did I get enough sleep last night, and the night before that, and the night before that? And Am I going to get enough sleep tonight? What am I going to do to be ready to go for the training session that's coming up for today? What about food and hydration? Am I using good fuel to keep myself strong? Or am I eating crap? What about vitamins and supplements? Am I taking the right ones? And am I taking them correctly? What about my weight? Am I maintaining a healthy weight that's going to keep my body strong and prevent injury and keep me performing my best? If I'm not healthy, if I'm sick or if I'm injured, am I getting the right treatment from our medical staff so that I'm back to full training as soon as I can? Once I have all the basics covered, I need to think about some of the more abstract things that go into training full time. How's my support system? Am I staying in touch with my family, my friends, and my boss, and everybody else who's sacrificed something to support what it is that I'm doing? How's my relationship with my teammates? Do they trust me? Am I somebody that they want to row with? Am I acting like a leader? Am I pushing them every day to be faster, stronger? Likewise, how's my relationship with the coaching staff? Am I doing my part to communicate? Am I demonstrating that I can still improve? Am I demonstrating leadership potential? And most importantly, am I demonstrating every day that I deserve the opportunity to represent our team and our country? Once I get to practice, it's really all focused on performing to the best of my ability every time I have the opportunity. So I have to ask myself, am I doing everything that I can to make the most out of the time that I have on the water? Am I making technical changes? Am I doing what I need to do so that I improve from the last time that I did this workout? And even with all of that, I need to always remember in the back of my mind somewhere that I am doing this for a goal that's larger than just this session. I have to ask if what I'm doing is ultimately going to help me win a gold medal for the United States this summer. And I have to take a second to ask myself if I've acknowledged that there are people who are training all over the world who want to beat me. So is what I'm doing enough to be faster and stronger than all of them? And it seems like a lot and you know at first it is but after training at this level for several years it all sort of just weaves itself together and in the end you really only need to ever have one answer yes